Hi, in this video, I'm going to introduce you to parent curves. Curves are used in the majority of the modeler's properties, which allows for easy modifications to be done to property values. When you select the generator and look at the property bar, you will notice most of the properties have some sort of curve next to them. The most commonly used curve is the green curve, otherwise known as the parent curve. This curve distributes values based on how far along the parent each child node is located. Now, I'm going to demonstrate some ways you can use the parent curves. I'll start with the spine length property, which controls the length of the branches. Now, I want the branches towards the top of my trunk to be shorter than the branches towards the base of the trunk. So I first make sure the parent level is set to 11 one branches, and then lower the right-hand point. For example, if you wanted the middle branches longer than the front and back branches, you just add a point somewhere in front of the left-hand side point, and then you raise it. Something to remember is that the left hand point is for the base of the spine and the right hand point is for the tip or the top of the spine. Next, I'm gonna do the same for my start angle properties. I click the curve, make sure I'm on the right parent level and edit. With the gravity property though, I'm just gonna to go to my curve presets and set the curve to linear decay. This is something that helps speed up the tree editing process. I will now unhide the twigs generator and explain how to incorporate the parent levels when editing curves. The parent levels allow you to edit a curve associated with the generator, which gives you extra control for fine tuning. As you can see here, when I lower the right hand point, the twigs towards the top of the big branches get shorter. When I switch to the trunk level and lower the right hand point, the twigs towards the top of the tree get shorter. The same concept applies to the other properties as well. You'll notice that when I edit the start angle curve, the twigs will get less of an angle at the tip of the branches. And after switching my parent level, they get shorter at the top of the trunk. With the gravity property, when I set the trunk parent level to linear decay, the twigs towards the base of the trunk will have gravity applied, while the ones towards the top will not. Next, I'm just going to quickly demonstrate a complex parent curve applied to the length of my main branches. To do this, I just need to click the draw button, draw my curve by moving my mouse, and this makes the making of complex curve shapes so much easier. Lastly, I'm going to show you how to use parent curves with seasons. So let's say I want the leaves towards the top of the tree to change seasons faster than the leaves on the bottom of the tree. I just select the green parent curve, select the trunk curve under the parent level, and lower the left hand point. Now as I mentioned earlier, you can alter as many curve levels as you like in the properties parent curve. So I'm just going to do that quickly. As you can see, by making these adjustments, I'm able to get some variation in the transition timing. Well, that is it for this video and thank you for watching.